Picture this, you start a brand new Minecraft world, play for a few hours, and then quit, never to play again. Well, it is time for you to enjoy Minecraft again, and I'm going to go through some tips and tricks on how to enjoy Minecraft again. So welcome back to the survival series. If you're new around here, this is a series where I don't cut. So if you want to just leave this video on in the background, I would really appreciate it, as it really does help out the channel. We're back here on my little fishing raft I made in the last video, here with Ralph, my dog, I'm going to take my bed, actually no, I'm going to leave the bed here, as I want to talk about how to enjoy Minecraft today. But I also want to do a bit of caving. I've also got bad luck, we need to get rid of that in a second. But Mr. Wandering Trader over here spawned, whilst I was doing a bit of fishing off camera. Didn't get too many good things, got a bit of scoop though, which was quite interesting. Does he have anything good? Just loads of mini blocks. We can trade him a few things I guess, but other than that, not really. So I think we'll just leave him behind for now. Let him struggle in the water. I think it's other llamas. Yep, right up there. I'll get Ralph. And I guess we should head back up as I want to do a bit of caving today. Get some more gear as I'm pretty undergeared. You know what? Dive these signs as well. I think that'd be quite nice. Just chuck the stuff in here, I guess. Put the scoots away. Paper away. And let's climb back up here. And yeah, so I want to do a bit of mining today. I want to talk about how to enjoy Minecraft again. And I also have asked on my Instagram story if, uh, for a couple of questions that I want to answer. So we're going to answer some of those as well. I want to grab a bit of iron, some coal and torches, obviously. There's quite a lot up here, luckily. So I'll mine a bit of this coal quickly. Just so I can have some torches, so it's a bit lighter in the caves. What day are we on? We're on day 28 as well. I hope everyone's having a great day. hope you enjoy watching this video. What have I been doing? Um, I've been... Doing the next Minecraft Hardcore episode, it's been a while, and I'm really excited to upload this one. It should be out on Saturday. I mean, this video is out today, and I'm recording this today on Thursday. So, hopefully I have time. I haven't started editing, so hopefully I'll have time to finish or completely edit it as well for next video. I need to milk this cow for milk quickly. There we go. But hopefully I have time to edit the next video before it's out, well, well, it'll need to be out on Saturday. It'll be a really good one when it releases. I'm really excited for it. I had loads of fun for one, like, for my first time in a long time, I just enjoyed playing on my hardcore world, which is probably one of the reasons I'm enjoying Minecraft again. Hello, Rufus and the Llamas. Still not named, you guys. Oh, well. Where's my valuables? Here. Yeah. Okay, definitely want an iron pickaxe. Got a lot of coal, so we'll bring some with us. That's a cobblestone barrel, is that one? Hmm, maybe not. Is that not? Since when, since when did I not have a cobblestone barrel? Oh, no, I did. Okay. I've got some birch wood. So I'll, I want to craft up a stack of torches to begin with. Like that. Chuck a oh no, sticks out of there. Keep that on me. I want to make myself a few tools. So first, an iron pickaxe will be good. What armor? I want to make a pair of iron leggings. They'll be good for protection. A pair of iron boots as well would be good. Take my level ones off for now. There we go. A bit more protected. Hopefully this will go somewhat better than I'm expecting it to go, I guess. Let's head to sleep. But honestly, I've just been enjoying Minecraft so much more. I made a video last week called I've Fallen in Love with Minecraft. And it'll be a similar video today. But I've just enjoyed playing Minecraft so much. I don't know if this is going to be a good case. So I want to walk off and find one quickly. We're very high up in the world as well. So I am using the Tectonic Data Pack. Which completely changes what Minecraft terrain looks like. But recently I've just enjoyed Minecraft so much more. Like, maybe it's finally get, getting back into my hardcore world. Because I did the restart video. The video, like, it's my worst performing video this year. It really demotivated me to even want to do ha the Hardcore series. But I just decided, if I'm not enjoying something, I, I, uh, I need to fix it. So, my problem was, I went uh, a few thousand blocks away with nothing except my Neverite armor. Cool concept. I enjoyed my time whilst I was there. But after a while, it just got boring. And, like, I'd log on for 20 minutes and then log off. So, the solution was... I had to head back to my base, which is what I did. So I head back to my base. And I made, I filmed the next video at my base. Built 
I built something really cool. It's probably my one of my favourite builds in the world. And I just had so much fun. Like, it's the most fun I've had in that world in ages. And that world's almost two years old now. So, I enjoyed it a lot. Hopefully we get some good stuff. Got a bit of iron. So, that's just how I've enjoyed Minecraft. Like, don't set yourself ridiculous challenges. Just, if you want to do something in Minecraft, just, just do it. Like, I wanted to do mining today. I'm just going to do it. I haven't built a base yet. Because I haven't really wanted to. So I'm not going to do it yet. So just do it. Like, that's my biggest recommendation uh, with Minecraft. Just, if you want to do something, just do it. Oh god, splashing everywhere. <coughs> I'm also a bit unwell today, so if you do hear coughing, I do apologise. I'll try not to make it obvious. Got loads of iron, which is really nice. But another way to just enjoy, like this world, this is one of my favourite worlds to play on in for a minute. I've been, like constantly, I wait all week to make videos on here. Because I don't want this just to be what I upload. I don't want every week to be this video. But like, I've enjoyed this world so much recently. And this is one of the reasons why I'm just enjoying Minecraft again. I created a new world and I'm enjoying playing on a new Minecraft world. Like just something about it is just so fun. And maybe it's the challenges I've set, like, we're on day 29 right now, I'm only half iron armour, oh no. No, I'm only half iron armour. I'm using stone tools, see. Uh, I'm using stone tools still. I've not got, like, an, I could have beaten the game by now if I really wanted to, but I've chosen not to. I've chosen to take it slow, and that's why I'm really enjoying it. This world is just so much more fun, because I'm taking my time. I'm like taking my time, being slow, and just doing what I want to do. I wanted to go fishing, for example, in the last video. I went fishing. I wanted to do mining. I'm just doing mine mining. Like, I've, I've got challenges on this world, but challenges that, to me, make Minecraft more fun. Like, for example, I'm not using mending in this world at all, which has been a more fun challenge. Like, or using mending only for, like, loot. I'm not trading for it, which just makes it more fun. Like, I don't need to go out my way to try and get an overpowered enchantment. So at the end of the day, mending is an overpowered enchantment. I would argue the most overpowered enchantment. Being able to, like, have your elytra or your pickaxe or your sword or your chest plate or anything like that never break. It's just, I think it's too overpowered how it is at the minute. And I know people are calling him, like, the villager nerfs and things. But I also think calling him, like, so basically, villagers getting rebalanced at some point. So you can only get mending in the swamps. Well, that's how it is at the minute. But I think... I've seen people talk about it a lot. I think it's quite negative to talk about it as a villager nerf. Because at the end of the day, it's a change. It's not... Like, a nerf is just going to make more people dislike it. So I would argue it's not uh, not necessarily a bad thing. It's not a negative change. It's a good thing. It's a good thing that we're getting uh, a new change. Like, mending's finally harder to get. Mending always was intended to be a challenge. When the old villager trading existed... It was a challenge to get mending. Like, but now it's not. It's easy to get mending. You just need to recycle the trades a few times. It's too easy to get, and that's I think that's a problem. I think that's my biggest uh, complaint with modern Minecraft, is just the fact that mending, a treasure enchantment, something that's supposed to be rare, oh, you can just talk to a villager and buy it. Like, that's stupid in my opinion. That's not how... It should work in Minecraft. And people say, oh, I don't want to transport the villagers thousands of blocks. Then just make a base out of the swamp. Like, that's one of the reasons they're doing it. So you create your own swamp village. Because most people don't think swamp, like, don't even know swamp villages, villages exist. But that's a point, like, they're not, they're, they exist as, like, a sort of, a thing only players who know Minecraft know about. But as a thing, like... You'd actually have to go out of your way to find. You can't just naturally go to a swamp and find a village. Like, I like the fact that you, you're sort of forced to make your own village. I think that's such a cool, cool little thing. Oh no. I don't know why I have my dog with me, by the way. It's probably not a great idea. 
cobblestone up. Anything up here. Oh, so it wasn't even worth coming up here. Never mind. Back down. Hopefully we find something interesting. But honestly, my, another bit, uh, another thing I'd recommend to enjoy Minecraft again is just try something new. Like, this is a completely new experience for me. Just playing Minecraft for an hour, recording the whole thing, just talking. And like with, obviously, some data packs installed. Like, I'm enjoying it so much. And I think it's just why. I'm trying something new. So like, for example, try modded Minecraft or even try a different version. Play an older version of Minecraft. Or if you play like 1.8 all the time, play a new version of Minecraft or... Do things like that. So you'll enjoy Minecraft more that way if you try new things. Even just, if you own both versions, play Bedrock Edition. Or play Java Edition if you play Bedrock all the time. I think that's definitely a, a bit of helpful advice. Like, just try something new. Or even, like, play a new snapshot to something if you haven't looked at it yet. Or if you want to wait for the update, prepare for the update if you have a long-term world. Uh, that's another thing. Always have a long-term world. Never have, never start a world for an update, for example, and then like, oh, that's my 1.21 update world. I'm not gonna play on it afterwards. Cause that just sort of ruins the experience. Like you have to do everything all over again. Like you may enjoy that though, but in my opinion, it's better to always have a long-term world, like something you can always go back to. Like my hardcore world, for example. Obviously, it's a hardcore world, so it may not last forever. But whilst I have it. It's been almost two years with it now. I've started in 1.18. It's my favourite world I've ever made. It's just honestly such a good world. And I love coming back to it. If I've taken like a week off, for example. Or if I've gone on holiday or something and not played Minecraft in ages. It's a fun world just to return to. And I'm excited to play 1.21 in that update. Now, experience all the new features. Now, that's honestly... I'm waiting very patiently for when 1.21 finally releases even if it's uh, like pre-releases or release candidates i'm updating the world just so i can make because i'm going to be making loads of videos on the hardcore world as soon as the update releases and i've been making two or three videos a week have a minute i think that as well has helped me with minecraft um just enjoy minecraft again just uploading constantly that's a vindicator I assume he's from the pillager camp, so we'll just leave him alone. But I've been uploading very consistently recently. Um, and that's just why I've enjoyed Minecraft more. Um, because I've just been... Any video idea I think of, I sort of just do now. Like obviously, I'm doing this weekly series. I want to bring back the Hardcore as a weekly series. Which ultimately means there's only one video idea sort of a week I need to do. Which is, I think it's quite a good thing. I've fallen in powdered snow. Oh no. Get rid of that. Oh, no. Uh, just run away from there. But, my, yeah, my sort of plan, hopefully, it works out. I say loads of things, they don't work out. But I'm hoping this will work out. Do this series every week. Now, whether it is, like, a video of how to enjoy Minecraft again. Or if it's just building in Minecraft or something. Do a hardcore episode if I can. Oh, an emerald ore. So, do a hardcore episode if I can. Careful. There you go. Um, do a hardcore episode if I can. Do this every week, which I know I'll be able to. And do another video. Like I like doing the 1.21 videos, like playing through the trial chambers. Those videos are really fun to do, and they do well, which is even better for me. But videos like that, I uploaded the useless mob video, which I'm not going to talk about. I've mentioned, I feel like I've not talked about it loads, obviously, in videos. But basically, I did a video saying use no Minecraft mob is useless and. Obviously, people say some, which are just, like, ridiculous answers. Like, llamas are useful. I've used them in this world, for example. And you get answers like that. But you also get answers like the bat, which I can see, in a way, people think are useless. But you can use them for things. They drop wither roses. That is a use of them. It doesn't have to be extremely useful to have a use, which means it's not useless. So that's, that's been my whole argument. And apparently, I, everyone's calling me wrong and, like, things like that. But honestly, I don't care. You may find it useless, but if I've used it, I used a bat in that video to prove a point. I used it. That means it has a use. So that's my sort of argument with it. Here we go. Alright. I know I'm back at base. I'm going to grab enough to make a bed. 
So I want, we'll do a bit of exploring. Just to see if we can find anything somewhat interesting. And I'll take a bed just in case. I'll leave the horse behind just for now. I want to craft some more torches if I can though. How many sticks? I want 16 to make another stack. There we go. Perfect. There we go. Oh, is this a good cave right under my house? Hmm. It's a big drop. Okay, it's not as big as I thought it was. Should probably have some blocks on my hotbar. That's probably a great idea to do. There we go. But my goal is to just be consistent at the minute. Like, two to three videos a, a week is my goal. If I can only do one, I'm not going to complain that much. I'm not going to... My goal, at least once a week. Like, I'll be annoyed at myself if I don't do once a week. I know, like, people say, oh, take your time if you burn out. But, like, I'm at the point where I don't think I'll burn out for a while. I know that's going to end badly now. But even if I do, like, I hope, like, this series, for example, that, like, this is literally a world I can jump on and talk for an hour, like, I can't do that with a hardcore, realistically. So hardcore's for my big project. Whereas this is just... I can do this for whatever. Like, for example, I'm talking about how to enjoy Minecraft more. But I can talk about anything on this, in these videos. Like, I mentioned live streams, obviously. I used to stream all, like, consistently as well. But I decided I didn't enjoy live streaming, so I'm not going to do it much anymore. Obviously, there'll be one-offs here and there. Even if I was to do live streaming, I don't think it would be, like, on this channel anymore. Because I know I've said this for about a year now. I'm starting a new channel, soon like a real-life sort of channel. I'm not going to share it much on this channel, just because... I don't want... Like, you are all subscribed for Minecraft videos, like... Or most of you subscribe for the Minecraft videos, like... No... I'm not saying no one's going to be interested, but not as many people... If you're subscribed to a Minecraft channel, you expect Minecraft videos. You don't expect real life videos or like challenge videos or something like that. But if it, but that's what the channel's going to be. So I'm not going to share it for that reason. I don't want just to get loads of subscribers and then to get like 10 views a video with like 100 subscribers. Like that's not what my plan is. Get him, Ralph. There we go. There you go. Heal up a bit. Loads of iron here, which is good. My main goal is just to get iron, honestly, and few more resources i want to get a bit a uh, bit more geared up in this world i don't really care about diamonds of a minute like when we're starting to build obviously i'll want them but yeah i'm excited to start that new channel I'll, i will always say i'm going to start it and never do but i'm almost guarantee i'll be starting it very soon i might even record the first couple of videos for it today now i'm not saying they'll be uploaded straight away but if I was to do live streaming, I think I'd just bring it back to that. I'd rather have, like, a real-life sort of element to it. Or if I, like, what, react to videos, I could do that on a channel. I, which I can't really do here. Like, obviously, I can do reaction videos on here. But they wouldn't do as well. I don't want this channel to be, like, basically Minecraft. So people who say, like, oh, you can try other games. Honestly, my answer is no. Not on here, at least. I might do other games on a new channel. But they also probably... I don't... I do, like... For example, Among Us, I I do videos like that on a new channel. I'm never doing like other games on this channel. I don't think. Even when like High Tail, if that ever releases, comes around, like I don't think I'll do videos on it. Just because it's not sort of what my plan is. This channel is for Minecraft. Like same way, like my face. I don't think I'll have face cam ever be in on this channel at least. Just because that that isn't like relevant for for this channel. Like. Everyone's here to watch Minecraft played by a llama. Like, you're not here to watch some guy talk to a camera. Like, I also don't think... Like, obviously, YouTube has used face cam, and I have no problem with it. I'll watch regardless, but it doesn't really add much to a video. Like, you don't need someone in the top corner, like, constantly. Like, there'd be elements of videos which I would love to do it in, and maybe I would, but like, you don't need... Me to be talking about how to enjoy Minecraft more and just focusing on playing Minecraft. 
I'm looking at Minecraft. I'm not looking anywhere else. Like, you don't need someone's face to do a video like, to watch a video like that. And that was very close to death. I'll be careful for a minute. You stay there, Ralph. Here we go. Eat a bit of bread. I thought that stone block was a creeper. That wouldn't have ended well. Loads of coal, which is really good. Anyway, I think in the next episode, I do want to start doing some farms and start farming. That's one of my favourite things to do as well. I can hear a bat, which means there's another cave nearby. And what does that mean? The bats have had a use, meaning they're useful and not useless. So my original point stands. So that anyone who's coming on that video saying bats are useless, just watch this bit here and I've just proved they're useful. I know there's another cave nearby because I heard a bat squeaking. Now obviously I heard a zombie as well afterwards, but oh yeah, there must be a cave somewhere. I'm... I don't know where though. Dig around, I guess. I'm around here. But that's just, I've just proved bats can have a use. Does the sea counter not work? No idea. We'll dig around until we find something. We're literally at ocean level. That's ridiculous. Cool if we did find a bigger cave to explore. Oh, we did. Wanna quickly craft up some torches though. Always better to have loads of torches than to have none. Oh, I hate these like really tight caves. They're yeah, very annoying. Oh, it's a deep bit. Now I wish I had a bow. Should have fished a good one up, really. You know what? We'll take a risk. That's another good thing to try. Are right, you Ralph? Oh, oh no. Oh no. This might not end well. So I'll screenshot those coordinates just in case. Where's Ralph? Where you up? Careful. I'm going to have a steak out actually. It's probably a better food source to try and eat. Oh, level 30 as well. Shame we're not going to be doing enchanting for a long time. What enchantment? Oh, curse of vanishing. I hope I don't die without chest plate. Just because I wanted to keep my original armour. But I'll also keep my first set of iron. I've got very low brightness, so I do apologise. But I just enjoy playing Minecraft more with like a low brightness, low fog setting. Ralph! Have a, uh, Ralph, you're an idiot. There was no one called Ralph watching who's just being offended by the fact I'm calling my Minecraft dog an idiot. Where's he gone? Is that my first time eating a steak as well? Apparently is. Alright, so he's not even been hurt. Oh, I, this is actually terrifying. Oh, there's an enderman there. You can just see purple eyes. Oh yeah, I've got a mending helmet. I know I said I'm not using mending, but like... I found a helmet early on. I'm gonna keep it. Ah! Oh, that was very easy to deal with. Get him, Ralph. Get him. Get him. Get him, boy. Get him. There we go. Ah! Ralph, kill him. Kill him, Ralph. No, no, no. Don't hurt Ralph. There we go. Ah! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Yeah, run away for a second. Minecraft, you don't need to have peaceful music playing when I'm about to die. There we go. Oh my god. Genuinely terrified me. That's enough way to make Minecraft more enjoying. Scare yourself. Oh my god. So I was more focused on my Minecraft dog than my own safety. Oh well. 
Getting you, Wolf Aaron, getting added to Minecraft soon, which I'm excited for. We'll have to get Ralph some new friends. Or oh, replacement by the time if he di ends up dying on me. Hope he doesn't. Ah, oh, go away, you stupid bony creature. Oh, and you stupid insect. Am I first time killing a spider? You can tell I've literally just been very safe in this world. Wow. I don't even know what that is, and that's cool. You know what, quickly, toggle on 500 gamma, which is five times brighter than bright Minecraft. Like, this is just not that enjoyable to play. I'll play it on my hardcore world. That's because I don't want to carry torches. But, like, yeah, this is just not this that fun to look through, like, look around. I'd much rather, I and mean, then drop it all the way down to 30. Like, pitch black, that's terrifying. Like, where's that zombie come from? Now, that's more scary than... Oh, it's a zombie coming. Better get my axe ready. I'd rather be scared. Like, that's just... It just makes it so much more fun that way, I guess. To me, at least. I Maybe it affects the video, but... Honestly, like, lots of these videos as well, like... I feel like with these videos, they're more in they're intended as well, just to listen to in the background. Alright. That's what I always say at the beginning, is like, feel free to put it on in the background if you if you can't watch all of it now. Because it just helps out the channel as well, but like, I would, what, like, if it wasn't my video, obviously, I'd listen to this in the background rather than... Get around. Um, I'd listen to this in the background. I wouldn't watch the gameplay because lots of the time the gameplay is not the most important factor in these videos. I mean, these videos were supposed to be relaxing, but apparently not. Got loads of good resources, though. There we go. Oh, we've dug into more cave. Oh, more zombies. I want to make sure this iron axe doesn't break as well because I want to keep my first iron tools. Go away, you stupid bony creature. Kill him, Ralph. There we go. It's about where's it gone? Emo bats. It would be cool if they did add like a vampire bat or something where it just it's a bat that can attack. Maybe even uh, maybe when it's night time or something. I'm trying to kill it, but no. Oh well. Thought I'd get like a mob head with it because I've got the more mob head state pack on. But apparently not. It'd be cool if like loads of them could spawn as well and like swarm you. I think that'd be quite cool. Um, no, I don't want all these torches. Actually, I want. Oh wait, no half. There we go. I like only ha there's no, no point in having multiple stacks at once. You know, it would be quite interesting if we do find some type of ores, but like some new other than iron, coal, and copper. But yeah, I'm not gonna complain if I don't. I'm enjoying my time just slowly getting some resources. Also, recently uploaded a video called "Building in Minecraft with No Plan." I re that video was decent to do. I I'll definitely do them again, but like in my hardcore world, I think I won't do. Them. I probably won't try them again in creative, just because for some reason I struggled more at uh, finding a good location and everything like that. But the video turned out all right, I think. I rushed it a little bit just at the end, just because I literally left it to Saturday to fin finish recording. That's a oh, we're at deep slate. Oh, that's a creeper. Ralph, watch out. Ralph, watch out. 
I'm switching axes because I don't want the iron one to break. Ralph, be careful. Be careful, Ralph. Ralph. Oh, be careful, you idiot. We're at Deep Slate level now, which is good. Maybe we will find some interesting stuff. Um, but, yeah, I basically left the video a bit too long to completely finish. Which is nothing bad with it. I, enjoy, I think the video is good. Is there a bee in my bedroom? I'm pushing my window up just in case. I swear I just had a bee flying around my head. That would be terrifying. Harry Delama gets attacked by a bee mid-recording. Already happened once on a live stream with a grasshopper. Redstone for the first time. Oh, that's good. Iron pickaxe is getting quite low, so I do want to be careful with it. Also, I hope we don't find a deep dark. Or just a drop into nothing. I put the brightness up, we can see everything. That just ruins it. And now I know I'm safe. Oh, the diamonds, though. Hey. Oh, I skipped the music. Whoops. I wanted to try and get those diamonds now. I've seen them. Can't even say it's cheating, really, because you can see it with default brightness. Not with my... Oh, no, you still can. Okay, well, I know where they are now. Don't know about the mobs. Now I do. Ralph! Oh, my God. Don't terrify me. Where are you? Hey, feed you. Oh, you barely got hurt. Stood up still good. There we go. Diamond. I mean, I... Deep dark? No, 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 no. Not going to the deep dark. Get him, Ralph. Don't hit Ralph. There you go. I think we're going to have to be very careful and not go into the deep dark. How many diamonds? We found one diamond before. But these are our first ores. See, Harry Delama just mined their first deep state ore. Six. Oh, we can make some diamond tools. At oh, my God. Uh, it's quite interesting to explore. Plus some decent XP, I guess. What's that, Ralph? You don't think it's a good idea? Yeah, neither do I. Maybe we'll hold off. I don't know if I have some gold ore I wanted. There you go. Stop getting hurt. Half of my six gone to you already. <coughs> oh no, my pickaxe is very low. Oh, I should start using a bundle. Oh, wait, no, I'll pick up the gold first. There we go. We in the deep dark? No, we're in a forest biome. Very foresty. Oh, now we're in the deep dark. Just gotta be very careful, I guess. Oh, yeah, none of it seems too bad. At the minute, at least. Oh no. Take out all the sensors. Then we're not in danger, surely. That's logic. Here's another bit of how to enjoy Minecraft more. Don't get killed by wardens. Or maybe if you don't know what a warden is, try raiding one of these cool deep dark things. As a sparkle. Does that mean diamonds? Gold. I'm not even going to bother. To be fair, there's no sensors, I don't think. I think... Whoa. That looks so cool. Definitely have to explore around here one day. That day's not today, though. Let's head away. Grab a bit more XP as well. Never know when... Probably won't be... For Actually... We've got enough iron now, so I want to name all the mob. Oh, no. Hey. 
Day 31, a month, over a month in. About to strike one, we've got three more left and then Mr. Warden says hello and... I'm not speaking to Mr. Warden today, I'm not gonna lie. This pickaxe is about to die, oh no. This is a perfect time to head home. If you can't tell for some reason, I'm terrified. Glow squids. I mean, I know I got some glow insects from fishing, but hey. Why? I'm scared a creeper will jump on my head, to be honest. Hey, as long as Ralph's okay. And me, preferably. Lapis. Could be good. Oh, it's got, uh, glow squid's dying. Terrifying, though. Oh, no, it was a spider. Oh, I don't like... Let's swim up here. And see where it leads us. I can see sparkles, but I hope it's just gold because I don't want to go. We'll have to come back eventually, I guess, and look. He's got the other half of gold armor I need. My. Stone axe broke. He didn't drop any though. Alright. What, what level? Getting higher now. I want to just head up to the surface as quick as possible now. Quite frankly, done with caving for now. So it's this pickaxe and I don't want to... I don't need to... I don't want to waste time smelting. That was quite successful. I got some diamonds, loads of iron, coal. Almost died to a warden. Best mining trip. Apologies if it is very dark. I can also not see a thing, so it's not just you, I promise. Why can I hear zombies? Have we found a dungeon? We have. Yeah, just check my durability quickly. Sorry about that, zombies. Appreciate Ralph being very helpful. Oh, he's getting that guy, that's why. Yeah, leave him, Ralph, it's fine. And what loot do we get in the zombie? I've screenshot those coordinates as well. Golden apple, gunpowder, coal, bones. Um, bundle stuff away. Melon seeds, a bucket, that's nice. And in this one, it's more same stuff. Beetroot is nice, I guess. Um, what else can I pick up on me? There. Who said bundles weren't useless? Not me. Um, what was it? Iron horse armor and music disc is nice, to be fair. All right, so what? Why level? Hundred ten. You know what? Should, I think best plan. Is to dig up from here. That's why I want to make a new stone pickaxe. You know, to be fair, we can craft a couple bits, a couple torches, free up some room, pick that up. There we go. You've been told never to dig up in Minecraft, but hey, it's fine. We'll try it. Should be nothing dangerous, hopefully. Place a torch each time. We're quite close to the surface anyway. But this will just be helpful to know where a zombie spawner is. So I want to make these basic XP farms again. I haven't made a spawner farm in years. I like, genuinely can't remember last time. Very close to the surface, see? And hopefully Ralph will pop up as well. Oh, we're very close to base. Alright. Well, I have to think of a base design. It'd be cool if we had a house over here and incorporated a zombie farm into it. Alright, so I've got two tools already to get rid of, not get rid of, retire, I guess. You know what? Grab my, I'll open Instagram on my phone quickly so I can take a look at some of the questions you guys had asked. What were they? Why are you so harsh on skin rating? So, if you don't know, I do a YouTube short series where I rate people's Minecraft skins. Why am I harsh? 
Um, it's because lots of them I don't like. I'm not a fan of... That's my answer, basically. I'm not a fan of lots of the skins. So that's my reason. I don't hate any... Well, I don't give 10s to 10s anyway, because... How do you have a perfect Minecraft skin? There's always something you can improve on it, in my opinion, so... That's why there's no 10 of... 10 of... Uh, 10 out of 10s, rather. In my opinion, I don't think there can be. Obviously, there probably can be, obviously, like... But, like... In my opinion, like, you'd have to do, have an amazing skin for it to be 10 out of 10. Or I'd wait, rate something 10 out of 10 if it was, like, for a joke, like, someone had a really, obviously, deliberately jokey skin. But I said, oh, yeah, 10 out of 10 because it's funny. So like, that's the only sort of opportunities where I'd do it. But I'm not deliberately harsh, like, it's just my opinion at the end of the day. Like, you don't need to, li if you, I rated your skin badly, you don't need to listen to it. Like, you should. Honestly, you shouldn't really care what someone else thinks of it. If you enjoy the skin, have it. It's yours. Okay, I want to make myself an iron axe and a pickaxe. We'll go on to the next question quickly. Um, which is... I'll hit my desk. What piece of work that you've recently done are you most proud of? So I'm going to do this in terms of YouTube videos. So which YouTube video recently that I've made am I most proud of? Hmm, that's a really good question, to be fair. What video have I done recently? I need to check all of the videos I've done recently. And which one's my favourite one? That's a great question, to be fair. Um, Content and videos. Okay, I'm going to look down. I'm going to see, for some reason, the How to Improve Vanilla Minecraft, which is the personal favourite. I've really enjoyed that video. I think that one, How to Enjoy Minecraft More, was a really fun video to do. Obviously, I created my dream Minecraft world. That's my most viewed video. I'm really proud of that one. I think How to Improve Vanilla Minecraft. I think that's just a, such a... It was such a fun video to make. I really enjoyed it. So I think that's my answer. When we change, we change the background clips in the shorts you make. So yeah, all my shorts basically have the same ones. And good news, I, the short that should be released today has new background which I'm happy with, made them earlier. So that's my answer today. But I'll probably use the old ones occasionally as well. Um, also, I'm doing Daily April, so I'm uploading a short every single day in April as well. I got, I'll tell you, well, there'll be a reason why at the end of the month anyway, but I got an email saying, oh, if ev so ev everyone who uploads dead shorts with a specific hashtag gets a reward at the end of the month. So I'm like, oh yeah, I'll try that. So I'm... Forcing myself to make another monster's daily short. After that, those shorts should calm down. Love your videos. Keep it up. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate that. Are you looking for an editor? Um, not actively looking. Not needing one yet. Maybe I'm thinking if I... If YouTube's earning money, I'll probably invest in one just so I can make more videos. Like, the summer's going to be annoying to make videos on all the time if I'm busy doing other things. Um, so in this summer, who knows, maybe. What's your most memorable Minecraft moment? Most memorable Minecraft moment? I don't actually know. One I always think back to is the first video I ever uploaded on this channel, which was that when I enderpearled, I was on Bedrock Edition on my Xbox, it was an Xbox clip. I was trying to enderpearl across to another island, but I hit the side and I fell down and died in the void. That always, I always remember that. Anything, probably in my hardcore world, starting that world was quite memorable. Like, building everything on that world. My hardcore world in general is my best world I've ever had as well. So I think that might be up there. I know, always you yeah, have the first memories of like, your first Minecraft pet and things and... Something like that, starting my first Minecraft world. I wish I remember more. But I guess something like that. And they're all questions, but if you want to... Let, leave uh, some comments down below as well. And I'll definitely be answering some more questions in the next video. Now, I think these are, this is a good opportunity to answer some questions. Just like any question that people have. I've just hit my microphone. Sorry for that. I probably made a very loud noise. But yeah, that's... I definitely... I think this is how I'm going to incorporate question... Like Q&A sort of style videos. So, I want to do farming in the next video. And I think over here would be a great place to sort of build it. Like some big field. I think that would be quite good. 
How long have we been recording? We've been recording 45 minutes. That's not too bad. We've done loads of mining and things. You know, oh, that's what I want to do. I want to craft an anvil to name all the pets and animals and things. There we go. 25 iron ingots. 31 we need, I think. Yeah, because it's 27 and 4. There we go. Like that. Oh, yeah. Chuck one out, Harry. You idiot. There we go. Heavy metal for is an advancement as we are using the blazing caves. We'll name the two most important sorry llamas, the two most important guys though. The main main two. Name him Ralph. And we'll name him Rufus. They're my two I hope I'm right. Hey, I'm look playing okay, yeah, Ralph and Rufus, perfect. There we go, sleep as well. It's been a couple of days and I don't want phantoms to attack yet. I think it would be a fun challenge to get some to spawn at some point. Here you go, Ralph. Finally got it. Finally earned yourself a name. And Rufus, finally earned yourself a name. Welcome. I mean, welcome is in. You have been here the whole time. You know what? I've installed the ship's data pack. I think I mentioned it in the last video. Maybe for the last bit of the video, I'll craft myself to have a boat. Oh, I've got loads of stuff in here I need to empty quickly. Hold on. But I think in grabbing a boat and just going exploring a little bit, that's our first diamond. So don't want to touch that. So put the other six in here. I guess mob drops in here. Just rest in here. I can't be bothered to organise everything for now. Five dirt. I like. I need to place all this dirt now because I'm finished with terraforming. But let's grab a boat and let's for the final bit of this video today. Let's try and see if we can find a pirate ship. If not, we'll just head back. There we go. Of course, it's not enough to make a boat. Only need one though. There we go. Apologies if, it, uh, apologies if there is any background noise. There's work going on, I assume, next door. I don't know what's happening. I hope you're still enjoying these style of videos as well. I'm just going to be making them as long as I can. These, I think these will be a consistent, at least once a week thing. Maybe eventually go down to two weeks. But for now, I'm just enjoying doing these consistent, just talking videos. Just playing Minecraft for an hour. It's just so much more fun. Like The first one I've almost like worried about doing and now i'm doing them every week this is what episode four three four five i don't know ralph sat down is that the first time we used a boat i thought we had one ready there we go come on ralph i'll check what episode we're on maybe we are this is for wow iceberg is that an ocean monument it is oh great what episode are we on what biome are we in as well? Deep ocean? No, oh, cold ocean. So, this is... So, we've done... Yeah, three episodes before this. So, this is episode four. Even though, these aren't really styled. Because I want this series to be, like, you can join from whatever point. What is that down there? I don't want this series to be... Oh, I didn't watch the first episode, so I don't understand. This isn't a... This will obviously have the progress of a world, but, like... Like, you don't need to watch a whole series. That's sort of my goal. Like, I don't expect people to watch a whole series to watch one video. If we go across the ah oh, polar bears, another useful mob. As you may have learned from my most recent video. Come on, Ralph, let's explore the ice together. Snowy biome here. Ralph. Oh, can we not TP on ice? Can we not? Oh no. Where's Ralph gone, guys? Oh, no. Should be panicking a bit more. Let's head over to... Here, and maybe he'll teleport to land. Snowy plains. My boat's just gone. My boat's gone. Ralph's gone. Everything's gone wrong. I don't want death message to pop in chat. That's the only thing I'm worried about. He's not being mauled by polar bears, has he? Ralph. 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 Why are you swimming over there, you idiot? Ralph. Ralph. Oh, he's trying to sit down. That's why. Might have a problem with our boat, Ralph. Might be stranded. 
Hold on, let's keep exploring for a bit. There, now you can follow on ice. So basically, I think because he was sat down in the boat, he's trying to path... Oh, no, our boat's fine. It's just glitched out. So he was trying to path fine to us. But he couldn't. Makes sense, right? Uh, no, because he was sat down, he's trying to find a block to sit down, and he couldn't. Got loads of sugar cane to pick up here. Best part about snowy biomes. Oh, the second best thing after this. Get in the boat, Ralph, come on. Oh, we're in portal. There we go. I'll leave him Ralph in the boat just for a split second as I go. To see what loot we can get. Which is I'm breaking one. Fortune three. Iron nugget. Obsidian. My first time getting a fortune item. Flint and fire charge. Can I get up here? Because I would like a gold block, please. Not even going to use gold much, but nice decoration, I guess. Oh, no. I just want to get up here. It's not too difficult. There we go. Boom. Maybe we'll find some sort of snowy structure we could explore in maybe the next episode. I know. I just love exploring. But the thing is, you're going to enjoy Minecraft more if you do the things you enjoy. If you set yourself tasks to do, which you really don't want, lots of time you won't enjoy it. Even though, like, I set myself a task on my hardcore world the other day to sort every shulker box. I've now got almost two barrels full of sh just, like, building shulker boxes. And that was fun to do, to be fair. Loading in chunks too quickly. Slow down a bit, Ralph. There we go. Now you can walk. On a snowy beach. I forgot a snowy beach was even a biome, you know. Oh, a pillager camp with a vindicator. If we can boat the vind... Can we... Okay, we can place boat on ice pretty quick. Or snow, rather. Quite easily. Just hope Ralph doesn't get killed by a vindicator. Oh, an igloo as well. Vindicator. Vindicator boy. Jump straight in my boat. Oh, they do so much damage. I wasn't even looking. I've got one trapped in the boat. How do we get in? Oh, round here. Up. There we go. I want my boat back, but also don't want to get close enough. So, all arrows. Decent stuff. Anything good in here? Just some brick. Well, it's a pot, so you get brick, obviously. Oh, a health potion. I want a brick, though. There we go. That was easy. Don't attack Ralph. There we go. Not losing Ralph to a Vindicator. That might be the worst way you can lose... One of the worst ways you can lose your, uh, your Minecraft dog. Worst would probably be him jumping down a desert temple trap and blowing you up. Hope that doesn't happen. Hope. I've got an arrow in my eye, by the way. Yay, it's got a basement. That means we'll get some good stuff down here. I should be using this bundle again. I always get half a bundle. There we go. What do we get? We get some wheat, coal, and apples and wheat in coal. And apples and wheat. Uh, oh, I don't... I'm going to leave. No, I'm going to take a wheat in this potion. The cactus is nice, to be fair, as well. Um... I'll leave a rest. Have a good day. We'll come back eventually and I should be marking things in my journal. I always forget to do this. This is the second time I've been exploring though, so it doesn't really matter. Um, here. Oh no. Ig oh no. Igloo. And we're at 563. But Y coordinate doesn't matter. I went 554. So not very far away. Nice. Let's explore a bit more of a snowy biome, and let's head home after that. As this was just a quick exploration. Oh, no, there is... Oh, it's a snowy village. I'll grab the notebook out again and write it when we get there. If I have to. 
Oh, a snowy village. Oh, that's cool. Literally, it's freezing cold in this bun. I'd imagine. I can't actually... Oh, a ruin portal. Oh, wow. Uh, you know what? Might not even loot this village properly. Might just poke my head in. We'll mark off the centre of the town as well. Even though... Or the ice in the middle, I guess. Not even in the middle. Uh, village. And we're at 763. So 200 blocks. Nice. 668. There we go. Hey, villagers. Hey, villagers. Oh. Two sp oh. Saddle, leather, helmet, and... Hey, nice. I'll take that. Don't shove the door in my face, though. That's a bit rude. Bookshelves. Oh, loads of bookshelves. Honestly, snow villages are some of like, the least common villages. So I don't know like, the layout of houses. At least we got all the books. I remember these being a great source of lanterns, but... I cannot be bothered to get every lantern right now. That's another pillager camp. Oh, no. We'll avoid that, don't worry. Not risking Ralph's life again. Or mine. In this chest, you get some golden nuggets. Definitely start. Well, we filled up a bundle. Curse of Vanishing, Fortune, Fortune, Efficiency 5. That is good. On a gold axe, though, so maybe not great. Let's... We're going to have to save a night of the village, and then we'll head home. Head back to the raft, I guess. Started the video there. We might as well end the video there, you know? Now, obviously, like, this is, could be a bit where I cut, but this is the no-cutting series, basically. There'll be cuts here and there, obviously, like. But, series where I basically record most things in one take. Stone cutter room. Hey, Mr. Polar Bear, please don't kill me. Emeralds I want. Don't need a flower pot to be fair. There we go. Out for bed. It's my turn. Apologies if you can hear dog barking as well. There's loads. For some reason, dogs barking outside. No idea why. This way back to base. Oh, I almost lost my voice then. Uh, this way back to base. Should we cat hunting rabbits? Hey, we'd probably get a cat at some point. I should probably get every pet though at some point. Ah, it doesn't matter for now, I guess. Yeah, that was the pillager camp and the igloo we just looted. Honestly, I like those pillager camps. And I know I said in one of the last videos, pillager patrols should have vindicators. But I don't take it back because I think it would be cool. But like, I also would hate that because I hate vindicators. One of my least favourite mobs in Minecraft is just how strong they are. Like, I know most of the time you'll fight them late game, but they just... Like, this makes it a challenge, but almost enjoy it. Like caving early, that was fun. Like, that was a challenge, which I enjoyed. Cormorman, Ralph. It's gonna have to start building soon. I need... Oh. Good, that didn't edit. Like, I keep saying, or oh, we're gonna build a house soon, but we need to build a house soon. Ralph, in the boat. There you go, good boy. All the way home now. And <laughs> use camera utils just to cut the camera off. That's quite funny. Oh, where are we going? Oh, spinning out of control. Honestly, the ice boat might be my favourite Minecraft mechanic. It's so fun. And we're going to go back on the ice here. Turtle, it's very cold here. I wouldn't recommend living here. Even though I guess where a turtle spawns, it's where a turtle lives. We're going to see our raft. There we go. No, that's some lava. Where is the raft? No, it must be further on, right? I actually don't know where it is. Oh, there it is. That's quite obvious, actually, with the... Uh, that's a nice screenshot as well. There we go. Even though the chunks weren't loading in. That's cool we got a massive monument, though. That, that would be a good video, just exploring a new monument at some point. I haven't explored an ocean monument properly in years. I always just fly in now and kill them as quick as possible, but I wanted to sort of take my time. Also, this could be a really cool base, like the holes in the side, wow. Alright, we're back at the fishing raft now. I'll sort my inventory out off camera, which will be a very fun thing to do. But I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe and check out my other videos on my channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. 
or maybe on Saturday when I upload my next video or in the next episode of this series. But me and Ralph will say goodbye for now. Bye everyone.